On the inside of the front row, Kevin Gambacorda, Michael Ray, these two have battled night after night here at Stafford and to the advantage. Gambacorda wastes no time at all, steps on the gas and pulls away. Further back in the field, we've already got some slicing and dicing going on, Kyle, as they work their magic back to the line. From about second on back, and Dan McCorda loves to see it in his rearview mirror as he begins to pull away just a bit from Zach Robinson in second in the 89. Tom Fern in the 92 in a battle with Michael Ray for that third spot. Also, Paul Verrecchio now among the top five in the 89. And while all that's been happening, it is Adam Gray with the number 97. Trouble now, Fern's car gets sideways, he backs out of it, and that costs Verrecchio a lot of valuable time on the track. They are slicing and dicing for that battle in the bottom of the top seven. Meanwhile, down the back straightaway, Bam Bam, Andrew Duran getting shuffled further back, Wayne Corey Jr., car number 10, white and orange car to the inside, and then it's Tom Butler. Butler makes a move. Oh, and Butler goes around off turn number four, 360 spin, and guess who? Tom Fern is underneath the Mayhew board on the back straightaway as he has come to a screeching halt with the number 92 car. Two of the most veteran drivers in this division collected on the back straightaway. It's last year's champion now. Once again, leads them back to turn number one, and Kevin Gambacorda. Kevin Gambacorda doing a masterful job as usual. Michael Ray continues to dig hard in the outside lane, but it is Daryl Keane. That's a brand new BFR car. And Daryl Keane quickly moves into second, and guess what? As quick as he gets in second. Oh, Ray out of shape, back straight away. That car will spin to the infield. Solo spin, well off the racetrack. We'll see if he can get that car fired up, ending to his open practice session last week, beginning to make his way toward the front of the field, just outside of the top five in car number nine. Trouble Corey now. goes to the inside, takes the four spot away from Zach Robinson, they are really bottled up from about eighth on back. They certainly are, and among the cars bottled up, it is Adam Gray whose car suddenly became evil. Just as I say that, Butler and Gray come together, and Butler literally at one point rolled up on the number 97 car. The 89 car has a tire, looks to be going down on the Zach Robinson Oh, car. Kevin Corda gets turned in turn two, and around he goes. With Keep a little bit of help, keeps his foot in the throttle and will lose two spots with Keane taking second, Corey third. Here comes Sturt now to the inside as around goes Gamba Corda. May have had some help there from Paul Verrecchio. Gamba Corda made a bid for it, but here is the checker. Hats off to Daryl Keane to take down the win.